guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a really fun fashion video for you guys. I felt like you were definitely owed one. I haven't done one in quite a while. So I went ahead and put together, I think it's about 20 pieces here, including shoes. That's gonna give you guys a great winter capsule wardrobe. So in my opinion, a capsule wardrobe are just those basic pieces that you can mix and match like a million different ways to create outfits really easily and really fast in the morning, but still look really stylish, put together and chic every single day. Tons of inspiration in this video. So if you are excited, please give this one a thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe. I make new videos every week on fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and everything in between. So definitely subscribe so you don't miss out. Let's go ahead and get started. So what I'm gonna do is go piece by piece and explain why I think it'd be a great addition to a capsule wardrobe and how you can kind of mix and match everything. And then you guys will see a ton of overlays where you can actually see the outfits put together with the shoes, with the accessories and everything. And I'll throw in some tips and tricks in the mix in there as well. So starting off with the first thing, I actually feel like pants are probably the biggest like portion here just because you want to have things that you can really build off of and I feel like starting with the pants you want to wear help you kind of build that base of your wardrobe. So the first thing and something I'm sure a lot of you guys already have but that's just a really great pair of blue denim that just fit you great that you feel great in. For me I work from home I'm a mom my lifestyle is a lot more casual so I love throwing on jeans, but I still want to look stylish. A lot of times I have meetings or appointments where I'm going to and from, and I want to look cute, but I just want to be comfortable in my jeans. So a great pair of blue jeans, the ones I'm wearing in the clips here are the ones that I have on now. They're from Reformation. I'll go ahead and link everything down below, but just a great basic that I'm sure most of you guys have. You can throw it on with t-shirts, sweaters, jackets, dress it up with heels, dress it down with sneakers. So many different variations. A pair of blue jeans is a staple no matter what time of year. Next up, we have the black pant, and we have a couple different options here. The one that I'm gonna be showing you guys today is a black leather pant. I feel like in the winter, every year, leather is like a staple for me. I just love leather pants. I just feel like they kind of give every look an edgy vibe, but you can still style them just like you would a pair of like regular black pants. So if you're not into the leather, go ahead and envision these outfits with just plain black pants. Um, but if you are, you could do a full pant like I have here. These are pleather, by the way, they're fake leather. Um, I think these were less than 30 bucks. I'll try to link everything. High-waisted, they kind of like feel and look like a jean or a trouser, but they're pants um, and they're leather. So I love that. I also love the leather legging, and I think that's a great option too. I know a lot of you guys probably already have that. I wear these all the time. Personally, I just think this gives me a little bit more structure, a little bit more coverage. I like the pant option, so I've been into it. Like I said, I'd style these like I would a black pant. One of my favorite things to do is really go from day to night in leather leggings. So this first outfit here, you guys will see me throwing it on with just a puffy coat. I can do a hat or a beanie, sneakers, a backpack. This is totally like chic mom life, running errands, running around town. I love this look. And then you can dress it up to go out to dinner, throw on a sweater, a jacket. Even if you have like a statement top that you already have in your wardrobe, some heels. It's a great, like, easy outfit. Like, if you're going on a trip and you're trying to pack light, leather pants will save you and give you so many different options. And moving on, this is going to be a wild card, but I'm really excited about it because I think the whole point of someone putting together a capsule wardrobe is just to make their life easier, but they're obviously interested in fashion and interested in having a really put together wardrobe. So I think a lot of us love white jeans. I wear them all spring and summer and I want to get more use out of my white jeans. So I want to start wearing them in winter. I love the winter white look. So what I would do is make sure you get a pair that's high waisted and I wouldn't do a skinny leg. I mean, you could, you could do whatever you want, but I think a, like a more of a wide leg look kind of looks like a trouser. It looks like more of a dress pant, but it's a jean, so you can dress it up and down. Um, but I just feel like it gives it a little bit more of that winter feel for some reason. So I think white on white, I think white with black, I think it's just very chic. It's a fun way to feel bright and fresh when the winter weather is just dreary and dark and it's just something different. Moving on to tops, the absolute very basic that I think everyone should own is just a classic white tee. Now this one in particular is really special. Like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and link it. Um, 
this took me a while to buy it because it's a little bit of a splurge but I wear a white t-shirt six out of seven days of the week like it's just my go-to and I've heard so many great things about this one specifically and it's awesome it just like cuts off right at the right spot it lays beautifully it's a little bit sheer but you're not going to see your bra through it it's just a great layering piece that you can wear in the spring summer winter fall you can wear it all year round it's i'm gonna say it's an off-white it's not like a true true white but i also think something great to have in your wardrobe would be a white fitted sweater or a white long sleeve shirt that you could use as a layering piece on those colder days or if you live in a colder climate where a little t-shirt like this just isn't going to be enough even on the nice winter days definitely just a long sleeve warmer more knit type version and you can interchange with any of these outfits that you guys are seeing and we could do a white t-shirt without doing a black t-shirt here too another one of my tips for you guys is when you're creating a winter capsule wardrobe in any capsule wardrobe you want to have a color scheme so for me this year i did white black tan and denim for me i just feel like that can all be mixed and matched really easily i could do those more girly feminine looks with the lighter colors i could do the more edgy looks with the black colors or mix and match them together so i always love to do some light some dark just get that little palette of like three to five colors and i feel like you'd be set and be able to get a lot of different pieces mixed together so speaking of denim I went ahead and added a denim shirt to the mix here. So like I said, it's one of the colors in my palette. I of course have it in my jeans, but I thought why not add a denim top? I've been seeing this here and there a little bit um, on Instagram and just in the fashion world and I just love the way it looks. I feel like I used to really be into denim shirts, gosh, maybe six, seven years ago. And I think they're making a comeback specifically oversized. So. I'm not gonna personally be wearing this like as a shirt. I'm gonna be wearing it as a layering piece, almost like a cardigan or like a denim jacket, but it's a little bit more lightweight than a denim jacket and you can put your coats on top. So I think it's just one of those great pieces that can add some lightness, add some different texture, different tones, and just kind of make an outfit really interesting. And to go along with the black t-shirt, just like I said for the white, I would recommend having like a long sleeve black fitted sweater in here this is kind of the one that i have you guys saw me wear the gray version of this in my video from last week the what i eat in a day it's just a very lightweight but warm knit and it fits like a long sleeve t-shirt so i love these definitely a staple piece so now we've done bottoms we've done tops and now i'm going to add in those layering pieces and those warmer pieces to keep you warm during the winter weather so First up, we have blazers. Again, it's another piece that I was really into. Um, and then what happened was, I think the style that, I think the blazers that are in style have changed. And so the ones that I used to wear, I just wasn't gravitating towards them as much anymore. They had bigger, bolder buttons, a little bit shorter, a little bit more fitted. And I love that look and I think it's a classic look, but I was looking for something that was a mix between a blazer and a jacket. So that's exactly what I picked up. This first one here is from Topshop. As you can tell, it completely covers my butt. So it's great with leather leggings. It's a little bit longer, it's a little bit looser. It's kind of like a men's blazer look, which I love. I just think the structure looks really cool. It looks really effortless, but it is gonna keep you a little bit warmer and it's definitely gonna dress you up if you have a meeting, if you run into the office, anything like that. Something great about this blazer is it also has a nice belt to really cinch in your waist to still give you that shape while you're wearing an oversized piece. I also went ahead and picked it up in black just to stick with my color theme here. This one is a little bit more um, of that true like crepey blazer material. I don't even know what it is. Um, a single gold button, not too much hardware again, just very simple, oversized. This one would be great for an office, great for dinner, drinks, whatever. Dress this up with jeans, with your leather pants, like literally anything, a black blazer is an essential. And I could definitely see myself wearing this into spring. I would just do it with maybe shorts, a denim skirt, pair it with those white denim, like literally so many options. Okay, and then for all you girls living in a super cold climates, I can't recommend North Face enough. They are a great brand 
Um, if you invest in a North Face jacket, you will very easily have it for the rest of your life. Like I've had some of my North Faces since I was like in my early teens and they don't go out of style. They stay warm. They're easy to take care of. So I went ahead and picked this one up this year. It's actually supposed to be um, like their style that they had in the 90s. They came back out with it. So it's a little bit shorter, a little bit boxier. I love the look. So cool. Great for mom life stuff. Super warm. I wore this when we went to um, Wyoming on vacation in the snow. It was freezing and this kept me extremely warm and comfortable. I love that it's really lightweight so it's not heavy on your shoulders or your neck. Um, and of course black I think just goes with literally everything. You can add so many cute accessories and give this more of a girly vibe if you want to. And then of course we had to have a statement piece in here and that is this gorgeous white faux fur jacket. So I think typically when you hear about a capsule wardrobe, it's all about basics, keeping it minimal, and I love that, but I still want to look really stylish, and something about a faux fur jacket, like just is my winter wardrobe dream piece, and this one is awesome. It's, it's very simple, honestly. It's just plain, like off-white cream faux fur, but it's just such a statement because it's long, it's more of like a trench style, a little bit oversized it's kind of chunky and it just makes a great very chic statement i get a lot of compliments on this every time i wear it and it's again something you can wear with the jeans wear with the pants whatever any color um personally one of my favorite looks is to throw it on with sneakers i just think it's such a interesting unexpected mix and i love the way that looks so let's move into some shoes speaking of sneakers i think a white sneaker is perfect all year round uh, but especially with these outfits. So I went ahead and paired all of them with my Golden Goose sneakers. These are just plain white sneakers with gray laces. They do have that little blue detail on the back, but I think that's a great way to kind of incorporate your personal style, maybe just your unique way of wearing things and brands that you like, stuff that you want to wear. They also have really cute sequin star on the side. I love these shoes. They are extremely comfortable. Um, they kind of come worn in looking, so you don't have to worry about keeping them pristine. The more worn in they get, the better they look. And I love them. I have a bunch of pairs of them. They come in so many different fun, like leopard prints and pinks and whites and blacks and just like literally everything. I all have like awesome sequins. So you can totally do a fun like statement sneaker. I just think these white ones, I get so much use out of them because they go with everything. I've been trying to find a pair of black boots like this and these are amazing. They are exactly what I was picturing in my head. I wanted a pair of boots that again I could dress up and down but that had a very low heel but they didn't look like, I don't know, like I still wanted kind of like that sexy girl boss power boot but I didn't want the high high heel. So these ones are awesome. They like the heel is literally probably an inch. The toe is super pointy, leather, really nice. They just like look like an extension of your leg when you wear them with the leather pants. They just, they're awesome, super comfortable, go with everything. So I have this weird thing where I can't wear black shoes with blue jeans. I don't know why, I just can't do it. Something about it, like whenever I try it on, I just feel like something looks off. But I've included blue jeans in this wardrobe because I feel like they're great for winter. So I'm not always going to wear my sneakers. I needed an option to wear my blue jeans when I needed a warmer shoe. So I found some white boots. These are awesome. I'm obsessed. I've been looking for a pair like this all season long. Um, again, that very pointy toe, that very little heel, but they lace up. I think that is so cool. I love the lace up. Really edgy and fun, super comfortable. They got these on Revolve and I just think they're awesome. I'm gonna get a ton of use out of these and then when we move into spring and summer, I could totally see myself wearing these with really pretty dresses, really pretty rompers, anything like that. A great versatile shoe that can be transitioned into the next season. And then lastly, once you get this wardrobe built and put together, what I would do is go ahead Take a night, have like a glass of wine or some tea and throw on all these outfits in every possible way that you can and snap some pictures on your iPhone and the mirror, save it to an album on your phone, like a little folder. And then in the morning, if you can't like think of an outfit and you want to look really good, you can go to that folder and you have like a hundred different outfit ideas saved and ready to go. 
So definitely do that. I will have links to everything down below. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel. I have a really great giveaway going on if you want details on it. It's on my Instagram on stories specifically, so check that out. And I will see you guys next time. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.